Packaging remains a constantly growing source of waste. Without action, the European Union would see a 46% increase in plastic packaging waste by 2030. To tackle this problem, the European Commission proposed to make all packaging recyclable by 2030. As for packaging materials manufactured particularly from recycled plastics, the rules are even more pressing. These materials may no longer be placed on the European market already after 11th of July 2023, unless they are, at least for now, manufactured from mechanically recycled polyethylene terephthalate. This material is also known to consumers as PET, for instance PET bottles. The new rules mean that widely used plastic food containers partly or fully made of polypropylene, polyethylene and especially polystyrene might simply become unavailable by 2030. But now they still make up a huge fraction of the food packaging market. The immediate answer is of course to use only recycled PET. Unfortunately, the reality is that the production volume of recycled PET, despite huge efforts of the plastic industry, remains too low. Paper-based food containers with barrier coatings is a good supplement and an alternative to recycled plastics. But this requires that the packaging can be recycled as paper and the barrier performance of coated paper is sufficient to protect the food, to secure its safety and the required shelf life. This means that the barrier coating must be very thin and should not advisably contain any plastics. At the same time, the barriers for permeation of oxygen, moisture, oil and grease must be like those of plastic containers. Danish Technological Institute has, in close collaboration with industrial partners, recently developed and pilot manufactured and tested a fully functional prototype of a molded paper dairy packaging container, a dairy cup. It consists of at least 88% cellulose fibers and the developed barrier coating doesn't contain plastic. So, the cup can be recycled as paper. Moreover, the laboratory tests confirmed that it is biodegradable uh, in nature environment and safe to put in contact with dairy products. Its moisture barrier performance is similar to that of commercial dairy cups, while the oxygen barrier is even 5 to 10 times better. We proved that the recyclable paper-based plastic-free cup for dairy products is feasible, but its commercialization requires upscaling of several developed production technologies and materials. We look forward to cooperating with molded pulp packaging manufacturers who would be capable and willing to make necessary transformations in their production and bring this product to the market.